So we're on our way. On our way up. Just parked the car. Little bit of info here. There we go. So, it's leg day today at the gym. <laughs> 1,038 meters high for on tool. We'll see you in a bit. Where we took off in the car park to where we are now we stopped to do a little drone footage over there by the pond but uh we're four kilometers into it now uh we're about 20 minutes from devil's ladder uh in general the walk itself is easy enough uh a bit tiring with a 16.2 kg bag on your back but We'll get there. Uh, great bunch of people here. There's a load of tourists, a load of other Irish people from all around the country walking. Just give you a look at Devil's Ladder there. Devil's Ladder is up there. Quick span around the scenery then. That's going through. Take a breather here before we attempt the Devil's Ladder, which is up there. It's going to be a big one. Look at that for a view. No. Your mask, that no gym with the dog. I bring my small dog in everywhere I go as well, Angie. Where I'm alone, man. We're about half halfway up the Devil's Ladder. Now oh, that's tough. It's getting tough. You can see. You play him up. You know. It's the bag, isn't it? 16 16.2 kg. It's just a joke. That's I'll good. do it once. That's what's killing him. I'll do it once. Just climb with a bag like this. Never again. It'll be the only time I video it. And use a drone and camera. It's just too much weight to be taking up the mountain. And a small little break here now. And we'll make a push for the top. But the top is... How far up? So this isn't... It isn't as easy as it looks, is it? Anyway, I'll check back with you guys later.
long way to you guys. Up to the ladder this time. Or I'll go up a little bit here. For a good bit from the top, that's dangerous. I'll go over this way. And time that much. It's tough, it's tough on the legs, you know. But we'll dig in! Oh, we'll dig in and get up there. The boys are going ahead of me. We'll get up there. So we made it. So we made it up over the Devil's Ladder. I'm not going to lie. The Devil's Ladder was tough. You know. If you're planning on doing this, hardest part is coming up that ladder. It's rocky. It's tough. It's difficult. Uh, it's worth it. Once you get to the top, look at this. Like you're on top of the world. <laughs> Halfway up that ladder, my legs were, were falling apart. Uh, I took a couple of breaks, dug in, got some water into me, and pushed up it. No. It's time to walk up that. So, that's it. Good luck. don't have to make a video now and just the legs the legs are tired you know so I'm gonna sit and rest for a bit just for the last push getting up getting up the last bit if you, if you want the picture you gotta deal with the pain right we truly have the most beautiful country in the world when you come up this high it's amazing I don't know if the GoPro is doing it justice but what I'm seeing up here it's just stunning seems like there's a dark cloud coming over us now these guys in the in the past there. It's a tough climb, I'm not gonna lie to you, it's a tough climb. 40 years old, carrying a big bag, camera, lenses, tripod that weighs three and a half kg, uh, drone, drone batteries, lunch, medical kit. Oh, you know. I probably only do this climb once in my life. And I'm going to get to the top, no matter what. I got up that ladder, that devil's ladder, and that was unbelievable. Serious climb, that. You know, Charlie, Charlie's son is with us, 13 years old. Young Corey, uh, he got up it, no bother at all. Charlie got up it, the big fella Mo. He's done this climb 20, 30 times, you know. He was up here on Tuesday. It's now Thursday. He's done this twice in one week, you know. He's a machine, that man's a machine, you know. He's he's, he's after taking my bag now because he, he wants to get me to the top. And that's, uh, to be honest with you, that's the only way I was going to get to the top because down there, I wanted to stay and just do pictures. 
before I were on the move again. I was just too tired. But you know, you just take a breath. You sit down, you take for two, three minutes, and you can go another 150, 200 meters. And that's what it's about, for me anyway. Uh, surely there's these endurance guys that are running up and down this. But if you haven't done a whole lot of hiking in your life, take your time, go get there. About 15 minutes from the top. Maybe a bit longer if I take breaks. That's it. the descent or the descent So we're about 20 minutes from the car, uh, job done, Curran Tool, highest mountain in Ireland, completed, oh, legs are like jelly, have to admit, you know, going up the devil's ladder is it's like you're, you're climbing up a waterfall, basically, and it's it's like well for us, for me, it was like an hour of squatting, non-stop, and my legs can feel it, you know, 
then when you get up up to the top of the devil's ladder you still got another 35 40 minutes to reach the cross but from the car park where you park before you start it's a four kilometer journey up that kind of terrain just to get to the bottom of the devil's ladder so it's up down up down there's no flat ground but look we did it it's done you know uh, you want to watch your step on the devil's ladder it's all slippy one wrong move as a guy a 35 year old coming down fell he had a nasty fall you know we stayed with him made sure he was all right but his legs are gone They're, you know he was in bad shape coming off that um, make sure you have gloves when you get to the top of that if you're ever going to take it on but I would advise you to put in some walking up Mangerton maybe look at this first scene up Mangerton up a few local mountains and just put the put the steps in you know um, I'm delighted I did it I'm not gonna lie it was tough when we got to the very top of Devil's Ladder yeah I was feeling it it's not like walking up Mushra or um, yeah it's kind of like Mangerton but it's a lot more vertical and yeah it's tough guys can't wait to get home and piece all the videos together and I suppose the next time you see me will be in that video but just look here we've got some uh, beautiful we're near sunset now so we're safely off the mountain which is a good thing uh, there's some diehards up there camping on the top of that mountain you know these guys you just gotta appreciate and understand that these guys just yeah they got something special inside in them when they can go up and down this like it's nobody's business and camp up there I can imagine the sun rises they're going to get up there just happy to get what I got anyway chat soon